Pull out white because when don't I not when don't I not Rocky use it? Are we ready to go? We good? We live? Are we live? <laughs> are you a turd right now? <laughs> hey everybody, welcome to Kimball's Corner. I think are we live? This is the part where everyone's watching the ad. Oh well, the people that watch it later are gonna start right here. They'll get to see all this gloriousness. Side effects of Symbolta include. Oh my Something. god. Skip it! Anyway, welcome to Kimball's Corner, where tonight I'm going to... Where tonight, Kimball believes it's all going to be cursed, and something bad's going to happen. Because today's been one of those days. I've got scabs to prove it. Okay. I'm going to do my favorite art technique, which is... I'm gonna... Snacks! <laughs> Thank you, Nona Ada. So, Nona Ada gave us these delicious, lovely biscuits that oh, we're going to eat. Mm, that looks Campbell, tempting. do you want to take a quick bite? Nice chocolatey biscuit. It doesn't really look like a biscotti. From Let there. me just put this over here so I can say what we're doing. Today. Okay, yes, go ahead. Sorry, after you go. So I'm going to. Elaine says, hey, all. Hey, Elaine. Okay, go. I'm going to spray it down with some water and then add some colorful inks to it. And I'm hoping it doesn't take too long to dry. I was hesitant to do this live because it might take a thousand years to dry. Campbell, we'll see. where'd yeah. you get the wood? You know, this wood came. From Michael's. No one asked. I just asked. In case someone. Why are you wasting my I time? Just, and everybody was wondering. Now I need to sip my coffee. This is what's happening. <clears throat> so good. Yes, it is. Oh, it's really good. I did a good job making my own coffee. Good job. I also have so, delicious coffee. Anyway, back to me. <clears throat> I'm gonna spritz spray. Get some drippy drops for the bloop bloops. And ooh, by the way, the weather here has been amazing. Um. It's been, AKA cold and rainy. Yes. And it's been keeping the cicadas silent and away, which I'm fine with. I am not mad at that. So are you okay that you moved it way up off frame? I'm going to turn it up right. Ah. Oh. You know, just give me a minute. I okay. trust in you. I just need to open up my incredible inks, which smell. Oh, I just got yellow. Elaine me. says, lovely shape. <clears throat> and the wood's not bad either. <laughs> oh, my, I got bazinga. And then Trisha says, hi, Kimball, K-Y-M-B-O-L, Rocky, oh, Jenna, my. and all. <laughs> hi. Those were the good old days. All right. So, basically, I'm going to spray some water on here, drop some inks down, and hope that it doesn't take too long to dry. Elaine says, Rocky, trust in the process. Okay, I will, Elaine, I promise. Nothing, what could possibly go wrong? I couldn't tell you that it doesn't drip like it does on <laughs> water or on paper. Looks like a dog walked by and peed on it. Oh, thank you. That's, just that's what I was going for. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It looks delicious. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that berry color is so nice. You're very nice. Oh, it's <clears throat> flirted. Delora says, hi, everyone. Looking forward to this video. Oh, honey, I hope I don't disappoint. Hi, Trisha, hand wave. Kimball is attempting to paint on wood with the Tons inks, of water. Which I don't think he's really done before. I have, but it just I know that it takes a long time, so I'm going to try and sop it up before it sinks into the wood. Gotcha. So you're going to just, like, speed up that drying process. You need more paper towels. Not necessarily. Okay. Just throw that away. Just throw it away, sweetie. Bring on the craft gun. All right, we're going, we're going light with the water on that. We just needed some color <laughs> down. Trisha confirms that she finally dipped her watercolor brush in her coffee today. <laughs> Welcome to the club. <laughs> uh, yeah, I keep my water and my drink so far apart from each other, but I still want to go for the coffee. Bobby Wasserman says, OMG, I'm actually on with you guys. Yes, you are. And welcome. welcome to the cursed episode where Kimball's convinced something's Listen, going to go wrong. Just today, I kicked, I'm, I kicked I the kicked bucket. I have it. Now, I kicked a covered coffee table at Home Goods, cut my leg open just a little bit, a little tiny scab. Sorry, Rocky, go ahead. I tripped going up the stairs. Rocky, that was funny. And Kimball tried taking three <laughs> pictures for his thumbnail that all got zoomed weird or didn't take the picture at all. And today's snacks brought to you by M Nona Ada, not sponsored. A nice chocolate loaf. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Home Goods. How was uh, it? I don't know. I haven't tried it yet because okay, I'm, I'm going to be the first one. I'm trying to like get something down so people are like, oh, he actually does art on this channel. <laughs> Here I am. Elaine said that is not a select club. I don't know what it was in reference to, but it was something we were talking about that I can't remember because my memory is like <laughs> dipping your seconds. paintbrush into your dream. Oh, okay. Or ew, this happened to me once when I used to use oil paints. Um, I thought I was gonna nibble on the end of it, and I nibbled on the bristle end and just got a mouthful of oil paint. So that was disgusting. This biscotti is really good. It's not overly sweet. You want me to heat it up for you? Oh, that sounds good. 
Mm. There were chocolate chips in it. All right. Some chocolate caffeine. Oh, my God. Get over yourself. Okay. Moving Rocky. on. Denise says, hey, everybody. Well. What's your smiley face? Is, you know, I well, think. You need more color. I think this biscotti could use a dash more sugar. Mm. I, seriously? I like you seriously think I need more color? No. Go ahead. I don't know when you're Ash says, hey, guys. Greenheart. Hi. Mm. I should draw a face now. Oh, where's my, where's my wallet? Oh, this is going well. 17 was on, obviously. Um, Tonight, I'm going to try... Tonight, tonight, I'm inspired by tonight. Alphonse Mucha, so we're gonna... It says jo Job Job. I've heard it pronounced both ways. Any hoodie. Before the live, Kimball's like, you have to help me decide. Pick between these 16 options. It was six, and he picked the one that had, the like, the tightest bun. The only difference is the teen, Kimball. So, anyway... That's the inspiration. Will I follow it to a T? I doubt it. We can't decide if it's Job or Job. So if you guys know how to actually pronounce the thing on there, let us know. I mean, I would say Job, but whatever. I'm going to okay, sketch her out in pink because it's sharpened. Because it's pink. I'm not terrified. Also, I'm not trying to draw like his exact style, just so you know. It's it's for reference. Trisha loves the way you heated the biscotti. <laughs> right? It was tasty. You made it better. <laughs> I'm, can we just, I mean, are these like 80s bangs or what? They are. He was I, way ahead of his time. Dude, I feel like she like laid her head on the ironing board, spritzed it, and used that iron and just pressed those bangs. Exactly. Okay, so mm, gotta leave room for that hair. Mm. And I may or may not use color sticks on this. I'm not entirely sure. I did do some samples on the back. It works very nicely on this wood, by the way. It has great coverage. Oh, well, I smudge it too. I don't I don't water it down, just so you know. So I was happy with that. I like that when you're talking to them, you look up at the camera. Well, oh, I was making sure I was... Well, he hello, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, was, I was making sure I put this back in frame. I'm a true professional, Rocky. Well, so is Denise. And she used the same wood she, when, when she was obsessed with drape handmade ceramics. With what ceramics? Drape handmade ceramics. Are you oh. not in the know? I'm not in the know. I know. Well, see, I had this grudge against ceramics because I was forced to do it in junior high and I hated it. Why? Because of the project they made us do. We had to like make, oh no, well, I think of sculpture, but like same area. Ceramics was fun, but the sculpting thing I hated because they made us do a stop motion video and I'm just, I know on all of that. And so that gave me a lower grade. I mean, I still got an A, obviously, but like I didn't get the award for best artist, which was very strange because everyone's like, go up there and get it, Kimball. You know, you got it. And then I, they call like another person's name who was very deserving. She was very good at art. Just in case you're wondering, Kimball's been the exact same way since he was like a teenager. <laughs> so even back then, if like he got an assignment or something or did something happened that he didn't want to do, he's like, oh, no. Right. Oh, no. Oh, I mean, OK, you know, perfect example. Science class, Mr. Pepley. And he Ooh, was that's such a nice name. Mm, yeah. That was he a nice person? Okay, go on. What's your story? So basically he was like, We're gonna go collect bugs and pin them to boards. And I mean, I don't like bugs, but I also don't like just killing something and pinning it to a board when I can like research it. So I was like, I'm not doing this, and I will draw and write up research reports on all these bugs instead. And he's like, No. And I was like, okay, well, I'm not going to do it. So he gave me two Fs because one was for like the actual board and one was something else, but I still passed the class. He, he felt bad. <laughs> and I was like, it's fine. I can do other things to get a good grade. Why am I telling this story? I don't know. Seventh grade, am I right? Everyone's just riveting. The comments stopped the minute you started telling the story. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? It's because they were all just very intrigued by what I had to say. Also, Jenna's running a little bit late. I don't know if she's here yet. She is not, but she will be here any moment. Probably. The comments will just light up. Um, Denise said, oh, I'm sorry. Amy says, I just joined in. I love Mooka. I'm Hi, designing Amy. a tattoo sleeve based on his work. Oh, fantastic. Are you doing like piecing together stuff? Or are you taking one of his finished pieces and doing a, a sleeve of it? And then Katie says, hello, hello, everyone. Long time no see. Hello, Denise hello. Says, Whoa, sorry. Denise says, I used to make trays and plates. You just oh, nice. lay clay on them. And then fire them in the kiln. Oh, and then nice. Beate says, hello. Hello, Beate. I'm not sure she would say it no, like I'm that. No, I'm pretty sure that's how she said. Hello. I don't, I, 
I don't think so. Hello. Um, well, speaking of weird voices, are we all excited for Hocus Pocus 2 next year? I know I am. Wait, what? Was there a preview? No, but Bette Midler <laughs> posted a thing about it, and I've heard about it a, a while ago. Mm. So I'm excited. I like Hocus Pocus. Yes. I remember we went to um, Salem, and like there's an actual place they filmed part of like some ballroom scene or something. And her house was there too. Something. Uh, the girl's house. Salem was I need to watch it again. It's been so long. Oh my gosh. Let's just drive to Salem. Why? I don't know. Something to do. No. Her hair, I'm going to do, I'm going to do it in my style and not the uh, Art Nouveau style. I can't uh, believe you just sketched that out without like sketching it. Like you. <laughs> you sketched it out without sketching well, it. Well, I mean like you just drew it. Well, I just don't understand how you draw faces without doing like the circle and then the lines like to, you know what I mean? Like, well, okay, I'm changing it into my style, but I just look at the distance between all the different things as I'm drawing them. And I decided not to draw her little cheeky on the other side, which I did here, but it looks like wrong. So I just nixed it, but gotcha. I don't know. I, they didn't really have fans back then, by the way. So to get her hair to blow up like that, they had a bunch of servants standing in front of her, <laughs> just blowing really hard. <laughs> And they didn't have mints either, so you had to feel real bad for her. And well, God forbid you just go out on a windy day, but let's see. But she's got this fun thing here. Let's draw these in before I forget them. Yeah, it confirms that I was right on how she said hello. All right, Rocky, hello. you nailed it. <laughs> All right, we'll probably bring out, I do have the pinpoint paint pens. I she don't says, know. Yes! Yes, queen, I'm everybody. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know if they're going to work on wood, though, because it might absorb like right into the wood. So I might have to, oh, I could use... Power pastels, that might work. By the way, in case you're wondering, yes, I do intentionally try to distract Kibble. <laughs> He's very good at it. It's like the physical challenge in Double Dare. It's like, can you imagine Kimball having to do art while going through a course? And then Denise says, what Ho Hocus Pocus 2? I can't wait to see that. I know, right? I'm Except excited. she screamed really loud. I just didn't have the energy. Yeah, thank you. Because I'm not drinking caffeine. Yeah, I'm really proud of you mm -hmm. for sticking to it for one day so far. Two days. Well, it's not really. That's helpful. a big deal. No soda or coffee. Hello. I'm sorry, when you were like, years ago, like, this is our last Diet Coke from McDonald's drive, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, okay, cool. That was when I stopped drinking soda. When did you start drinking soda after that? It was like four months after that. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it was even that long. But like, whatever, right? Because we love each other. I remember I was on the road. And on the road again? I went to some like hot dog place and it was the first soda I had since then. Hot and I was dog. like, I felt like I was cheating on you or something. You whore. I had to like call and tell you right away. <laughs> I was like, I'm, I'm sorry, like, baby. I was like, oh. I had a soda. <laughs> and he's like, all right, okay. I'm like, oh, okay. That's, I mean, thank you for telling me. Except I think you were like, failed. <laughs> I'm like, you, how dare you betray me in such a way. Ash D said, oh my God, physical challenge. Do you guys remember Mark Summers, by the way, the host of da -da -da -da. Da -da -da. He talks like this and comes back down every time. Uh, the man's a genius. All right. So she's just got some little loopy boops in here. Oh my god, loopy boops. I gotta add that to the dictionary. That's how you style the hair. It's the loop boop. Loop boop. I, mean, I think that might out. be distracting if I do it red. So I may not do red back there. One second. I'm gonna write this down. I'm just eating my loopy boopy doop boop boop, 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 boop. I know. I'm like, wow. I think it's really good. I know, because you don't like sweet things. Why do you like me so much? I'm like the sweetest. I'm gonna dunk it. We're dunking. What was it? Loopy boops? What I don't know. Uh -huh. Campbell, what was it? I don't know. I don't gloopy, was it Gloopy Boots? Can someone please tell me what it was? I already forgot what it was. I'm so sorry. What was the? I'm trying to like keep track of all Kimball's dictionary words. Oh, someone had a dream about us. All other comments get skipped. <laughs> Katie says, I had a dream about you and Rocky the other night. It was a Kimball's Corner vlog, and both of you guys were visiting a friend who was giving you guys a drag makeover. <laughs> That's something definitely you don't want to see on me. Well, yeah, me either. I think mm -hmm. you'd be pretty cute. Um, I just don't do the drag stuff. I did for like Halloween when we lived in North Hollywood, like in 2000. That wasn't drag. Like you a... did your hair in a bun and like wore glasses and a mini skirt. You little Although I did it six library. times once I dressed up as like a courtesan. Courtesan? A courtesan? Courtesan. I'm a courtesan. Like between croissant and croissant. A croissant. I'm going to just clean my palette really quick because. Yeah, everyone was wondering. I know. It's just a little dirty. Kimmel, you need to get a porcelain palette. Made I know. Different cute animal shapes. I know. I was going to order one off Etsy, but who has the money? Am I right? Oh, like, thank you, Elaine. It was Loopy Boops. Ah, Loopy Boops. 
loopy boot. Now, Kimball, can you please just give me... That sounds like how you do a corset and like securing the boning. You're like, I'm gonna just use some loopy get boots. Get off the corset topic. Can we get back to loopy The boots? corset. Making a corset using whale boning. Which is worn by who? Cortisons. All right, so... Oh my God. So what is loopy boots? It was her hairstyle. It was the lines in her hair. Why am I eating this chocolate um, biscuit of random sadness? Random loops drawn oftentimes in a mooka portrait as hair or clothing, as mm. hair or hair or <laughs> your hair. All right, well, I've got it. Mixing up the skin tone. That is added to the dictionary, which started with Spladouche, Kershmere, Spritzo, and now Loopy Boops. They're basically all the same thing, except for Loopy Boops is a drawing. I feel like they're all slightly different and have subtle nuances. You're a subtle nuance. <clears throat> Beate says, I use vintage devil egg plate for watercolors. Ooh, that's super smart. Oh yeah, I could go get, they do have porcelain. I keep seeing the porcelain egg plates all the time. But, yeah. But I'm like, I want something cute because I'm me. Well, are you saying that she didn't get a cute thing for hers? I mean, a, ridiculously cute. Like oh, okay, the cat ones that I saw. I mean, I'm a cat person, but I'm not that big of a cat person. I don't know. This needs like... Katie says, no, it seemed like you guys oh. have been dared into it. It was really hilarious as... Neither of you seem to want to be there. Kimball and you may, were made up as your mermaid, merman inspired drawing. It was Aww. adorable. Oh my, I'm all, oh, what a cute dream. I have no I idea. Wait, my dream. I don't know what this is going to look like. I don't really have a test. Oh, that's totally fine. It looks like a delicious stain. The stain. You stay over there. <laughs> Bye. You, you keep your witty comments to yourself. I don't think I have to work tomorrow. <laughs> Me either. Well, it's much darker than I thought it was going to be. Water. Amy said, Kimball Merman has been giving me life this month. Oh, Except Kimble she Merman. said like this, Kimball Merman has been giving me life this month! Oh. He makes his appearance a few times a year. True. He cute. Is it weird that he's like slightly sensuous? I don't know. Do you not see it that way? No. I do. That's because you see it as me. Ew. <laughs> Elaine says it's a bank holiday here in the UK tomorrow. Yay! Yay! What is a bank holiday? Does it mean if the banks take the day off, everyone does? Seems right. Or like if the banks are closed, nothing can operate. Seems right. I've heard it here in the States too, but I just haven't like really fully understood. I feel like I heard it when I was a child and it was one of those like, I don't need to know or don't care about it. You're like, does not apply. Shh. I know, like, shut up. I just want to like fully get the biscotti out of my mouth. So I don't have like that jammy texture going on. I'm sorry. What are you putting in your mouth these days? Like sticky. I don't know. Oh, okay. You stop right there. You stop it. <laughs> All right. Hair color. Tealy blue. Purple. I never do purple hair. Let's do purple. Okay. And it's over the yellow. So why not? Well. Complimentary well, colors. It's, it's going to make it look brown. <laughs> Elaine says it's a public holiday, so no work. Yay! Holiday! I said yay. For the public holiday. Well, it really spreads out after you start adding it, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Thanks, fun. Yeah. I'm not sure why. Well, if you had to get a breed of, of dog, what would you get? I really like Sheena Ebus. Are those like the tall... Um, corgis? corgis yeah. I also like corgis. They're just so happy. Like, how can you not look at a corgi and be like, oh, you are happiness in a pup figure. <laughs> I don't know how to word that. that. Was great. No, really I don't think it. I could word that any better, mm -mm. to be honest. By the way, what's everyone doing today? 
While you're typing, let's talk about the glorious, glorious weather we've been having, like thunderstorms, lightning that scared us and the neighbors. I legit think I went into cardiac arrest when that hit. Like I was it so was, shocked when it when the lightning hit right next to our house. It was it was so like loud. cannons going off. And like sent a shock through my whole body. I was so alarmed. Our neighbor came outside and he's like, I screamed. <laughs> oh, I love our neighbors. That's like getting bitch slapped by nature. Dude, it was so intense. And it happened three times. There was one that was very loud. And then two that happened really fast right next to each other that, whew, I tell you. Sometimes you just want to sit on that porch and get a little scared by mother nature. I love it. I love storms, especially in the Northeast. Like when I grew up growing up in Idaho, the storms, like you'd have lightning storms, but it would be like lightning every couple minutes or something. And then out here, it's like lightning every 10 seconds or five seconds. It's just like crazy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm not sure what the hell I did with her hair up here, but she's not sure either, Kimball, but she trusted you. She's giving you side eye, but it's not because she's like apprehensive. She should be. I'm questioning every brushstroke. Okay. That's all skin in there. Denise thought something was funny. Well, it's probably the way you were looking. Rude. Just kidding. <laughs> You're pretty funny, but looks aren't everything. Kimball, here, have a, have a um, wheat biscuit. A whisket. Whisk it away. <laughs> I can't really call it like a biscotti if there's not sugar in it. I know. I'm like, isn't there? There is sugar. Is that how they get the calories down? Wait, how are the calories on here? Let's find out. One piece is 150 calories. Okay, I think I've already had like three of them, so I'm going to stop. Are you serious? Uh-huh. No, I had two of them, actually. You turn such a little piggy when we get <laughs> when we go live. But surely, I mean, it's not that big. It's but I'm not going to go for 450 calories tonight. I'm just going to go for the 300 I already tanked. You're really strong. Elaine says, I've been doing more, um, some more mermaid and chilling with hubby and my pooch. Oh, nice. Oh, and her pooch is a Bichon and mini schnauzer. Oh, nice. Adorable. I wish you could send a picture because I want to see that. I want to see. Oh, Denise says the lightning recap was hilarious. <laughs> Trisha says, we had a month of rain, hail, storms, but this weekend is gorgeous. Wall to wall sunshine, tomatoes in the greenhouse, and plants growing well. I've been gardening today. Oh, fabulous. That's see, I'm, I'm okay with the warm weather. I'm just not okay with all the bugs that it brings. And... Just with the whole cicada thing, obviously, I'm terrified. In well, that. Kimball, no bugs, no hugs, okay? That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> you stay on your half the room. Well, if there's no bugs, nature would just fall apart. Would it, or would it find a way? It would not find a way. This is not Jurassic Park. <laughs> Katie says, I've been testing out my new pin, pinpoint paint pens. Ooh, they what you've been doing? Amazing. I know, what right? What have you been doing with them, Katie? Yes. Katie. S Katie, ah. I'm just really adding a lot of color. I don't know what the heck I'm doing. It's like she's made of neon. She's something. And I am here for it. Oh my god. I mean, I was going to do purple in the hair, but it wasn't looking really what I wanted it to look like. So I changed it. You're welcome. I was just looking at Nona Ada, who gave us the snacks made in Italy. I know. Now looking closer, she looks at her, very she happy. Kind of, she kind of mm, does she? She's all like, "Hey, I didn't put sugar in these." <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Now that I'm looking at it, she's like, mm -hmm. "She's all jokes on you, fool." Yeah. Now I know why they're at Home Goods. They're good though. They're not bad. Yeah, they're so great. Nah. Oh my god, yum! Burns and fucking goodness. I didn't hear what you said, but it yeah. was funny to watch. Yeah, you hear it. Um, Bobby says, I live in Florida and we have lightning so fierce, we are supposedly known as the lightning capital. I love storms. Hmm. I can imagine lightning storms in Florida being incredible because of the humidity and the heat down there. Yeah, I couldn't do it. Mm -mm. The bugs, humidity, and the heat. <clears throat> Plus, yeah. I'm just not like a beach or party person. I feel like that's a lot of stuff that happens in Florida, like going well, to the you ocean. No, Kimball, you haven't been. Yeah, but I've been to a beach before. True. We need to go to Florida at some point, though. Do we? Bobby, do we need to go to Florida? You're the ones you all like, Kimball. you're like, I went to Disney I went World. To Orlando. Like, yeah, I want to go like, somewhere else in Florida before I like weigh in. I'm sure it's so different. Like, I, we, <laughs> like, I feel much different going down to the Keys or like down to like. See, I feel like that's like people that like to lay out in the sun and like lounge or go to like partying clubs. And mm -hmm. like, I'm not about any of that. Yeah. I'm all, give me a huge city and, you know. Well, Trisha says your cicadas made the UK news yesterday. Oh, that's. 
That's terrifying. And Yate says, I haven't seen any cicadas this year, fingers crossed. Yeah, I saw, I've seen hundreds of them. Uh, and then it just, I mean, okay, because it was like, what, in the 80s and 90s? And then our weather, like the high today was like 50. So they're all just like hiding away. And I'm fine with that. So Katie says that she did a swatch and did a Zendala for the first time. I don't know what that is, but she's trying to get used to the drawing different thicknesses in lines. We'll be posting it up on JD Facebook page a later Zendala. today. Zendala, it's kind of probably like a Mandala, like it's all little patterns and designs and it's very Zen. We'll assume that's correct. <sighs> Uh, no, I was kind of asking. I think that's what it is. Okay. I'm not sure. Oh, Jenna's late. Everyone, can we all give claps for Jenna? For Thank you, Jenna, for showing. We love you. She says, I misjudge how long it takes to get across town. I've been listening while driving home, though. Oh, that's Aww. good. Thanks for joining. It was oh. a pleasure. So I am tempted to add a dash of color sticks to this. Yes. So Jenna, if you're just joining, Kimball bought <laughs> a piece of wood from Michaels and is now using incredible inks. You say that like I haven't like prepped her before. Watercolors to draw. And he used a pink colored pencil to sketch it out. And he's using inspiration from Alphonse Mucha. Jenna gets behind the scenes. She does. I, I just wanted to illustrate how much better Jenna is at doing that than me. I just want to see how this is going to work over the, the things. Oh, Jen's getting all the claps. Yay. Yay. We know who the real star is here. Actually, if you guys are on here, I'm very curious what happens to Kimball's analytics when there's like more thumbs up. So if you guys are enjoying the content, please give him a thumbs up because I want to see if that affects um, his anything on his like data because we really are so like behind the times. <laughs> how we should what actually is be doing a channel. We kind of just like threw a camera up and started filming, but don't haven't paid attention to like what actually helps this channel. So if you guys like it, please give thumbs up and we super appreciate you guys. I'm not desperate. <laughs> That's what it sounds like to me. Well, whatever. We are desperate. Anyway, though, can we see how gorgeous this is covering? It is. It's so pretty. I was like very worried about how her face was going to stand out from the pink. Well, I'm wanting, oh, like you didn't think it was going to? Yeah, because it was so dark. Right. Well, I mean, colored pencils would come to the rescue, but I wanted to try this first. I mean, that's so pretty. I'm just, I'm not covering everything yet. Hey, calm <laughs> down. Calm down, Cabbage. <laughs> this is why I don't wear lipstick. I'd fling it everywhere. Oh, my Lord. Amy says that is looking amazing. Why, thank you. But it you. wasn't a question. It was more I know. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> That's what she said. She screamed. Amazing. Oh, okay, that sounds like Miranda. <laughs> Gary, let's do a bit of a sack. And then Dolores says, hi, Jenna. And then she did this, like, hand thing that looks like this. But it's like this. I don't know what it, I'm not sure what it, it's like a weird hand thing, but it's funny. Uh, um, I don't understand, but I believe you. Okay. Beate says, I forgot to thumb up, <laughs> I forget to thumbs up the lives. I remember two on normal videos. Oh, thank you. I mean, it's okay. You, you thank know. her in, in person, Kimball. Get, okay. get under there. Okay. Thank you, but this isn't really in person, Rocky. This is still <laughs> on the camera. <laughs> but thank you. I appreciate it. Things are coming along. Katie says, I thought you had run out of your color sticks, Kimball. No. <laughs> I I ran out of this, uh, this color, um, but I do have extra packages because I'm a hoarder. And so as the colors run out, I just pull them out of the new box and put them in here. Uh, uh. Shut up. <laughs> Elaine says you only wear lippy in Katie's drag dream. That's right. There you go. Yeah, I just, I mean, I don't think I would look good in lipstick. Shall we find out? No. That'll be the next live. We'll just lay your head down on the, on the, the table like you're the canvas and I will paint your face. Oh, that, yeah, I trust that. <laughs> trust the mess. Okay. Getting my warm pink. I think everyone's on board with that idea. Except for the one person who needs to be on board with it. <laughs> I mean, if I don't have to do anything, I'll, I'll let you go to town. I kind of want to make it look like it fades off down here. You know what? gets me about art is someone like Alphonse Mucha can draw inspiration to do the original piece that he did. You can draw inspiration to do your own version. Someone can look at yours without even knowing who Mucha is and take inspiration and do their own thing. And then mm -hmm. you have just all these iterations of art 
that are all just inspired by something that happened in the past. I think that's like one of the most incredible things about any kind of art, whether it's music, painting, photography, any of that stuff, graphic design. I think it's just like such an interesting community that people don't even like understand. Not even community, just like evolve evolution. Did you get paid for this TED talk? Or? No, I didn't. <laughs> but I did keep it to five minutes or less. So oh my fun. God, you are skilled. All right. Wasn't planning on using this much, but I'm loving it. Every time Kimball is about ready to go live, when it, I don't know what, he basically is counting down the hours all day on Sundays. <laughs> I'm one of those people where like if like five, I have an appointment, my whole day revolves around that appointment. Like we went out at 4.30 and Kimball's like, yeah, but we need to be back. I'm all, like two and a half hours. I was like, I know it only takes 20 minutes, but <laughs> just so you know, I have two and a half hours to get back here. And then like six hits, he has alarms that go off and then his, his, all the blood drains from his fingers. And then he has to touch uh, my face with his fingers to prove how nervous he is, as though I don't know already. Well, you think I'd get better. At he's something. just like a nervous wreck. Every, it's hilarious. And then he goes live and he's fine. Every yeah. time. Well, especially if I like where the direction's going, which I do like the direction of this. So it's kind of like, wait, why did I lay down all those inks when I just covered them? Elaine says, ah, oh, bless. Bless it. Ooh, bless it. Okay. I think, well, maybe I'll do this just so people know that's her shoulder. It's just the idea of flesh. <laughs> just Yate says, we are very intimidating, Rocky. True. You guys, be less intimidating. It's so fun. That's what I say to him. Like, I'm all, like, they, like, they just don't, it's like, we all just, we're here chatting, like. Even if the artwork doesn't turn out, like, we're still just hanging out. I don't know. I get weird. I just really want to create something that's, like, we can all enjoy. Good luck with that. You know what? Just Shut kidding. your pile. Um, Wrap it up, Kimball. And we're done. Just kidding. I I don't have a white. Oh, I, no, I don't want to use that. What I need are the the marzipan twists what i need is a pencil sharpener there it is marzipan twists uh yeah they're they're jeans they're kind of like what we are replacing the color sticks but she has a white in them is she not selling the color sticks anymore no remember the factory burned down I'm like oh part. yes I'm like how could i forget i don't know i don't really know you're a mystery <laughs> elaine says we are your public and you will entertain us okay <laughs> I think there was emphasis on the will. It's like, we are your public and you will entertain us. I will entertain you. Um, should I do color sticks in the hair too? You do whatever sparks your fancy, Kimball. Or should I just like leave it weird colored and then like do the colored pencils and kind of add to it? Maybe you I'll do pencils. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Yeah. No, it's really, you nailed it, Rocky. When you give two options, you always do the second one. I do what I want, really. I give out the one that I really want first and then I'm like, but no, I should give options to make it sound like I, you know. Well, there you go. Oh, I'm so indecisive. What do I do? <laughs> so I'm going to put these aside for now. I do want to pull out the Power Pastels. Because they might go on top for her little hair doodad thing. Okay, and back to one. So... You really centered that well. Good job. Oh, thank you. I've had practice. It's almost like you can look at a camera. I'm drinking coffee now. How's the battery on the camera? What does it say? It says I'm giving up on life. It's full. Okay, good. I I think I'm just going to do like a dark... Do I want to do brown or blue for that one? Oh, God, these decisions. I think I'm going to go brown. Turning it over, testing it out. Mm. Drawing it on and casting a doubt. <laughs> I never doubt. That was what she needed. I mean, don't have to get quiet. I'm just kind of going over my pink lines. How often do you get to a point in painting or a piece that you're doing and you're like, what do I do now? Oh, start to finish. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, oh God, so much pressure. The next stroke could be the one to ruin it all. I know. And before I was into doing mixed media, I was very panicky because like, if I mess up, what do I do? I can't cover it up with some other mysterious item. Ah, refreshing. Just fixing my straps. 
did you intentionally color coordinate your wrist? <clears throat> Sorry, your watch strap with your art supplies. No. Who does that? <laughs> You don't understand how many comments Kimball gets in public about, hey, man, I love your shoes match your top. <laughs> like, Because he has, like, a different color of Pumas for every single occasion. And so I legit, like, hoodies. every other time we go out, someone's like, oh, man, I really like your shoes and they match your top. Well, that's because that's all the effort one needs to put into their outfit. There you go. So if you guys really want to get compliments in public, just match your shoes to your top, apparently. Or the other day we were at Home Depot and this guy was like, sir! Sir, sir, I love your hat. I have one just like it. <laughs> I was like, okay, get back to work, sir. I was like, my hat's fun too. <laughs> but I, is my, it? My shoes are cool too. Are they? And then they just like look away and pick up. As they should. I'm giving her blue eyes stuff because I don't know if I like that brown. We need to liven her up. She's ready for the party, Kimball. She is the she party. She's stepping out into the 80s. The 1880s. <laughs> You're like the funniest person I know. Okay. And I say that because you're like the only person I know. So there was this... Well, no, I, I shouldn't tell the story. It's a private story. I can't tell it. Never mind. Fine. Never mind. Right now you just piqued everyone's interest and they're all just like... Well, I was going to talk about the trip to Germany. Oh, gotcha, yes. But like, We'll save that for a different time. Yeah. Oh, look, she just got her brows done. Soft, subtle so brows. Pretty. I feel like I should paint her lashes. Like, her eye and stuff's all quite dark. Or it's not dark. I mean, it needs to be darker. I feel like your motto should be like, what rules? <laughs> <laughs> Katie says, Kimball. Yes. Could you do a video to show how you cr uh, cross? Uh, sorry. Could you do a video? Show us you cross hatching technique with the pinpoint paint pens. Never fully grasp how to use cross hatching for shading. I could definitely try. The only thing I, the only problem with that is I did that for a test to see how they worked and they worked well but also like I, I would have to work small because I don't want to waste all of that paint on like a large piece I did start a large piece and I was like oh my god it's using up so much ink so I can you show with regular it. pen or is that different well I mean I'd show with the paint pens it's just okay you can create the tiniest piece ever Kimball right I'm just saying I would, I would do the small piece so Katie that's a that's a maybe. We'll see what happens. That's a maybe non-committal yes. <laughs> My life story, really. That's the Kimball way. I was dying because someone, Kimball's dad sent him like a, an article from high school. And in the article, it was like, Kimball's the most like nice and compassionate person I've ever met. And then the next sentence, he's like, I hate when people ask me to draw them. Like, I get so annoyed. Well... <laughs> It was like back to back. I was dying. And there's a story behind that. It's because people that I didn't even know or wasn't even friends with in high school would come and be like, hey, Kimba, la, la, la. Will you draw me a picture? And I'm like, no. Like, if you're here just to get a picture from me, like, no. Like, you're not even nice to me. Exactly. And yeah. And where are they now? Hello. Hello. Um... Trisha says, I've reached the age where if my shoes are on the right feet, I'm pretty pleased with myself. <laughs> Good um, job. And then Katie says, even you. if I, it was just the eye, that would be great. Yes, I can definitely do that. I will do that. I can maybe do that at the end of this. Yes. Maybe. Stick I around. Say, maybe I say. That's a that's a hefty, firm, non-committal yes. Absolutely. The percentage went from 10% to 30. <laughs> it's really just zooming along. All right, how is this looking? Like Katie says, woohoo! <laughs> I think it's okay. I don't love the brown line. See, I shouldn't have done brown. We all know better. Can you go over it? What is it about the brown you're not loving? <sighs> it's just boring. Mm. 
Like I could have done this really vibrant, beautiful blue, especially next to that pink. I mean, it seems to be covering it pretty well. Down there, it's not a big deal. Whatever, whatever. Okay, fine, whatever. Uh, also, I think if you do color pencils first and then you paint on the wood, I don't think it bleeds out too much past the color pencils. Wait, say that one more time. Like if I drew this line first in colored pencil uh -huh. and then I painted with watercolors, yeah, I think the pencil kind of holds the watercolor in more place. so in place. Yeah. Okay. Got it. Don't take my word for it, but I think that's just what Eddie I think. I think. It sounds good. No idea. Eddie, I think. I think. I think. So what am I doing now? Who am I? Where am I? What's going on? Her. You've been hair. avoiding her hair. Absolutely. Jenna says she's looking great. Thank you. Well, since Jenna said it, I know it's true. So we're going to mix some of that down there. That's what's happening. And I feel like next time someone's like, Jenna, what color are you going to do your hair? She's just going to be like, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can you paint with all the colors of Jenna's hair? Yes, you can, technically. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I love you very much. Let's see. She says pretty much. That's how, that's legit how I told like the months apart is like, what color was Jenna's hair that month? Oh yes, okay, December, got it. I fajudged up on her hair because it hit the color stick and went whoop, because it's slick. Oh, you better be careful, Kimball. Well, and I was trying to, because like I didn't color, and where's my, where's my color sticks? You need to go all the way up to the hair. Line. Yes, clean. Hey, what is this color? Oh, why are you just, it's in the wrong thing. Jenna says just as soon as it gets long enough. Oh my God, my hair is so short still. It's so cute. I love your no, hair. Oh my God, you're like so cute. Yeah, You're're thank you. Me. But like, I miss long hair. I want it like medium length hair, I think. Just to give it a couple of years. You're going to like wake up and I'm going to be like next to you in bed with like scissors. Just be like, snip, snip. Okay, that one movie with Sir Michelle Gellar where they cut off her hair. Was it Cruel Intentions or something? No, it was that. I know you did last summer. Ow! I don't, I don't know her. I don't know you anymore. I don't recognize this place. The picture. What do you call the technique for like the way you do your lines? Scribble bops and hope for the best, yo. Scribble bops. One of them technical terms. Scribble bobs. Everyone write it down. I feel like this might be too dark, so we're just gonna lightly. I'm writing definition down. I love how they're all like related to art. Scribble. I would hope so. <laughs> Scribble bobs. Well, purple look weird. That's fine. All right, now let's bring in some white and create some highlights, yeah? Does anyone do this where, like, you haven't written in a long time and, like, suddenly you've just forgotten how to write cursive or you just, like, start combining letters that make no sense or just, like, adding an L randomly? Not so much me, but there are times where I'm like, how do you spell the? <laughs> wow. <laughs> like, And then I'm like, do you smell toast or taste pennies? Scribble bops means Please randomly both. drawing lines with no rhyme or reason, especially when drawing hair. Yep. So we got that written down. Oh, and there's another word that Katie brought up, which is fajudged it. <laughs> and she wrote it out for me, so I don't have to. Oh, nice. F-U-J-U-D-G-I-E-D. -E got it. Definitely sounds like something I would say. And then dash it up. <laughs> For judge you for judge did it up. Um, I'm not even sure what the exact definition of that. I'm gonna go with like effed it up, but like in in a different way. Drew the wrong thing in a PG kind of way. I need my sanity back. Let's see how this yellow looks. Hey, hey. Uh oh, did you just for judge you did it up? Well, it's been very cold in here, so I think all my stuff is 
Ugh, doing its own thing. Testing on the back. Oh, that's very orange. It works. Hey! <laughs> oh. Lipstick problems, am I right? That's funny. Why is it funny? Because I said. Oh my god, what you say? Scratch to Beauty by Zandra says, Hi, Kim on Rock. Hey, Zandra. How did your life go? I was busy shopping for. What were we shopping for? Patio furniture. Outdoor furniture. Jenna says, Elaine, no, I appreciate you keeping the teal pressure on Kimball. <laughs> and Elaine says, I love a bit of teal too. Blue heart. I love a bit of teal too. Maybe it's teal heart. Teal of hearts. Let's make it neon yellow. Katie says, when your color stick make you slip while drawing the hair, if it judge it up. <laughs> Heck yes. <laughs> That's how that goes. Mm, I feel like this yellow needs to be elsewhere because it's very strong. And gorgeous. She kind of makes me think of Polychrome from Wizard of Oz books. That's the vibe I'm getting. I'm writing definitions down. Leave me alone. Oh, my God. I love you, too. Okay, so Judge Eat It Up. I did my best to, like, translate this, guys. For Judge Eat It Up, drew the wrong thing by accident, or when another art supply causes a different art supply to react unfavorably. I'm going to... I'm going to say something naughty, but... Wow. <laughs> well, I wasn't going to be naughty, but it sounded that way in my head, so I stopped. You're welcome. Scraps to Beauty by Zandra says, Kimball, I gave you a shout-out on my channel tonight. Oh, thank I you. didn't know you had an Etsy and hope to do one of your mermaids next week on my channel! Heart oh. your mermaids. Oh, Heart you. your mermaids. Thank you. I I wish I wasn't so lazy because I have like a couple more coloring pages I need to upload. We'll see if I get to them. No promises. <laughs> so Wait, I guess is that the bright yellow looks like a oh, highlighter yellow. Yes. Okay. So I think I'm gonna just stick with color sticks because they're working very well. Power pastels. You're lovely too, but I don't need you right now. Um, I'm gonna go... says I always do a thumbs up. When I get here, mm -hmm. the you. color sticks are really vibrant there. They are. They're gorgeous. I'm loving them. I'm going to do this thingamaburbs in color stickies. So is this one that's falling out? Yeah. Let's see. This part was like kind of gold. So we're going to do that. And then I think these had like... Is this where you've already stopped looking at the reference like... Oh, I haven't looked at it. 80 minutes ago? Yeah. Well, what do you talk? I'm just making this gorgeousness up as I go. Elaine says, where is a word from our sponsor, Noah, tonight? <laughs> Gonna try and make it look goldish. I'm gonna have to pull out some brown. Denise says, Rocky, you're a master of writing definitions for new words. You need to work for Merriam Webster. Heck yes. They wouldn't have me. They, they were like, we think this is too advanced for you and you're gonna get bored quickly. They couldn't handle his brilliance. I was like, you write. I'm going to go apply it Cold Stone Creamery. <gasps> Ice cream. Apparently when you apply it Cold Stone Creamery, they make you write a song. No, nope, no. Nope. I wouldn't do it. That's like worse than having an icebreaker at a t like a group party or like a group team thing. What color should I make the little blibbity balls? Should I keep like, should I bring this pink? I'm going to bring the pink over. I think so. I, I, think, I so. think that's the right choice. Jenna says that Noah's watching random YouTube in the living room. Oh, so like suddenly he's busy. Like, <laughs> Katie says she reminds me of Dawn Vita Tessie S girl. She's a burlesque dancer. Vita Von Tess. Tess, yeah. <laughs> She's a burlesque dancer. Scraps TV by Zandra says, did Kimball just so before using color sticks? Girl, you know I didn't. <laughs> that would have required effort. Yeah, I don't I never gesso anything ever. Jenna says she worked at Cold... Oh, sorry, go on. I was going to say, I don't like the texture. I don't believe in their political views. Uh -huh. All right, so Jenna says that I worked at Cold Stone when I was in college. Jenna, were you forced to write a song? And if so, can you please sing it for us in the chat? Um, Leah says, that was smart thinking to get extra color sticks. Um, have you tried the marzipan twists? Yet? No! And everybody's using them, and I'm so jealous. <laughs> They look so fun. I would what use them, I would use them the same way. They're just like these. Well, I don't oh. know if they're just like, but they're similar. I'm sure the formula is a bit different, but they're still like an, a creamy, smushable thing that's water soluble. 
Beate says Miriam Webster would be scared. I would fajudge it up. <laughs> <laughs> Beate um, says blibby blops is another one for the dictionary. I, have I not written down? I have scribble bops, but not blibby. I have, Get I, it together, I Brewer. I have loopy boops and scribble bops. Loopy but I don't boops. Have boops. Loopy boops sounds like a weird bra. I'm just going to throw that out there. Well, don't be coming up with different ideas. Let don't. me just go put on my loopy boops. Blibity. Libity lobity loopy Bops. boops. Um, okay, pulling out Blibity just Blibity blobs. Blibity blobs. I want I want it all. Layer cakes. It's my layer cakes. I want to use layer cakes. And I'm gonna add, I'm just doing it because I need some more precision. And I want neon yellow. Probably. Highlight these just ever so slightly. Actually, I can probably use use any of the yellow, really. Whatever. Just using yellow. Everyone's just trying to keep you quiet tonight, writing definitions down. I know what's going on. <laughs> You're like, hey, if you, go, if you keep throwing out words, Rocky won't be able to talk as much. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out the good definition for blibbity blobs. How did I use it in a sentence? I feel like it's when you use, like when it's a nondescript shape or something and you're like, we're just gonna put some blibbity blobs over here. Yeah, that sounds accurate. I'm like, yeah, let's go with that. Let's see, let's put a little white highlight eight, highlight eights, highlight. But it is water soluble, like the uh, color sticks. So this might just turn to a pink color, I'm not sure. All right, I put, Blibbity blobs. Little blobs or circles used as a nondescript shape or accent in an art piece. Nailed it. It's forcing me to believe I'm it. I'm so tired of definitions, I have to use the restroom. <gasps> Why'd you abandon me? Talk about something interesting! I don't... What? So... Rocky's in the bathroom. <laughs> That's not interesting! <laughs> it might be interesting to somebody. We all have our kinks. <laughs> this is worse than texting on my phone doing this. What are you doing? Nothing. God, I hope you're not doing. I'm just using the restroom. I don't know if I believe you anymore. I'm going to close the door because I'm modest. Now I'm scared. All right. Added that bit. I want to get this like ear is disappearing. So I'm going to grab the other layer cakes with flesh tone in it. Probably this one. Yeah, sure. Why not? Rocky, I'm scared. Ah. I have performance anxiety. <laughs> there's pills. <laughs> he said there's pills. That needs some more gold in it. Not quite the same color, which is fine, whatever. Let's add a little of the brown. Sorry, I would ask questions, but I can't read the answers. All right, I washed my hands and I just dried it off on your bath towel robe. Cool, no, that, I appreciate that. It was more convenient, I got here back faster. That's all I care about. Well, now she looks pretty. Um, yes, why now? I don't know, because I went to the bathroom. All uh, right, let me see what I missed. Well, I had, I was asking all sorts of questions. Everybody was really excited about it. That's a lie. Jenna says she did not have to write a song for Cold stone? Yes, but I did have to sing for my tips. Oh. Oh. And, not this dude. I mean, not really. I would I would actually enjoy that. Give me a biscotti, yum yum. Denise says she was married to Marilyn Manson. Oh, uh -huh. Oh, half or whatever. Yes, the other person that you just mumbled out your mouth with crumbs flying all over the place. Um mm -hmm. <laughs> Leah said what lol Bobby said thank you for saying you don't use gesso I have been told so many times that I have to and I don't like it that much I'm free now thanks <laughs> you are free yeah I 
I never ever use gesso or matte medium. Well, do you judge people and that do Kimball? No, do you think it definitely the worst. I think you're the worst. Okay. No, it definitely <laughs> serves a purpose. Like if I did it on this first. Don't yell Kimball. Oh, sorry. I think I'm talking over this, but it's not loud. Um, like if I did it over this first. Can you just whisper it, Kimball? Just whisper into the mic. Come on, you, get in close. You know what? I don't think you're done going to the bathroom. Okay. Um, if I <laughs> if I had you know, just so this first. <laughs> Um, Please do an ASMR the, like the, that. The watercolors wouldn't have bled and whatnot, but I personally don't care about the watercolors bleeding. So it's personal preference. I'm going to get you to do like an ASMR. We're getting two mics and literally you're going to go back and forth between the mics and be like, today we're going to do some art. Thanks for joining. And then you'll like take a piece of paper and just be like... <laughs> And then you'll get your art supplies out and just like slowly move them around. I'm all. <laughs> that's my that's my watercolor brush. Oh my god. That sounds like a delicious dish skit. It does. I all think right. I would totally watch that. Is she done? She's not quite done. No, mm -mm, she's not quite done. I need, I need everything. I need to paint the border. And I'm not a hundred percent. Gigi's colorful world says hi, Kimball Rocky, and everything. One. Hey Gigi girl, welcome to the life. Dipping my biscotti from Nona Ada. Thanks, Nona. Love ya. Grandma Ada. Whatever. <laughs> you just pick it up and put it back. I need I need more. You can tell she legit was like, nah, I didn't put any sugar in that. So eat up, children. I feel like we should just have her like, we'll cut her out and just have her like sitting right there on the screen the whole time you do art. Yeah. So should if I anyone flick wants gold to see on it? Yes. Or should I just do like a gold around the border? I think you should do gold around the border, but also flick some gold on it, but not on her face. <sighs> so I did it on the back. I was doing tests. I really like the subtlety of this. I don't even know if you can see it. You can't. Not really. It's basically just glittery see-through. And then this is the gold fine tech. I also wiped it as hard as I could with a paper towel. Oh, okay. That probably helps. <laughs> Katie says she's not sure if she'd be creeped out or soothed by it. The ASMR. <laughs> but the silver shows up the most. I just don't think silver would be like the right choice for this. Okay. I like the gold better. I guess I also have the purple. It's just it's hard to make them shine. You like the what better? The gold? I think so. The gold fine tech. Do you have like a really gold, like almost like gilded gold? A gilded gold. <laughs> um, <laughs> God. Um, Trisha says that that's, that sounds too creepy, Rocky. Yeah, I have and to live with that. say hi to each other. And then Le uh, Leah says, once at a cell phone store, the managers required applicants to take hilarious IQ tests. I refuse. Hmm. Good for you. So anyway, back to me. What? <laughs> Beate says, what kind of Nona gives people cookies without sugar? Nona I failed. know. <laughs> so true. <laughs> so, we got colors. We're probably going to just go gold. That seems like the right choice. Rocky's writing. He's, he's writing. Okay. I, it's not very dark, though. So what should I... I'm just going to do it. Why am I asking you? You're writing something. Let's pick a gold. There's so many different golds. I was just writing the Nona out of failed. <laughs> oh. Failed. So these are the Nona. gold. Which gold do you like the best, Rock? <gasps> um, they're, they're in that same order. I think I really like these two. Okay, just pick one. That one. Fine. Let's do that one. Oh, hey. Um, da, 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 says, da, da. I just got marzipan twists. They're on my table right now. I'm so excited. Why don't you just rub it in my face? <laughs> Wait, yeah. that sounds gross. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm so excited. Rub it in my face. Ew. Yeah, jealous because he didn't have them yet. I am jealous. But Someday. Not really. He'll get them. Someday I will get them. Okay. So yes. I don't want, I don't want it to be like a solid cover i want it to just be sparkly shiny so when it dries people look at it and go oh wow it's glittery trisha says is nona at our real person trisha i know what you're doing tonight on google <laughs> research miss nona made in italy i'll probably find out she like went to prison or something for like not oh, having, for maybe like, she made them from prison from mislabeling oh maybe 
prison labor. I'd be like more down to eat them actually, if that was the case. <laughs> I do love a good prison sweat cookie. I am all about supporting people who are on the mend. <laughs> is she on the mend? Yes, if she is finding ways to be productive and I'm sure she's gonna get on parole this time. Absolutely. I feel like I'm just gonna- And Kimmel, make sure you have to do it in a way that's interesting for everybody to watch. Dab, dab, dab. <laughs> like, don't spill it down the front. I wouldn't. Okay. How dare you make me do things? Oops, I got it on the front. Did you? Yeah. You want to get it off? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, no, I'll just curse splat some stuff on it. Okay. I think that's pretty. Oh, yeah, thank you. Here, all my favorite part's the edge. <laughs> Excuse me. Beate says she's not on the mend if there is no sugar. Well, you yeah. know what? She might have diabetes. We don't know. She is trying to watch her sugar intake. Um, Leah says the woman you're painting is like if a Hitchcock heroine came alive in high-tech neon color. Yeah, I believe that. I believe that, too. I firmly believe that. Let's Elaine says, bless you. Thank me. you. Excuse me. Sorry. God, Rocky, you're a disgusting human being. Kimball will sneeze sometimes, and I'll give it a good, like, 10 seconds before I say bless you, just so he can get, like, a little bit angry. I don't get angry, but I do remember one time we were on choir trip, and I think I was getting off a bus, like, to in Utah, and I sneezed. Sorry, go on. It just legit looks green from over here, where it's, like, shiny. It's so interesting. You're full of the best stories. Sorry, Back go on. to me. So... Anyway, I sneezed and like nobody said bless you. And I was like, well, bless me. And then our teacher, Mr. Chodorica, totally started laughing. And I was like, what? And he's like, nobody ever says bless you to my wife. So she always says, bless me. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good story. I think so. I got it on the front. You didn't even have to be there. That's right. I didn't even have to use visuals this time. Hopefully it's dry on the other side. As I'm just like rubbing off the paint as I'm painting it on. Is it even in screen? Like, yeah, totally. Everyone's just, just they're amazed and delighted. Well, by hey, all if you're amazed and delighted, like and subscribe for more quality content <laughs> like this. <laughs> Denise uh, says, "Kerplats, ker splat some stuff on it." Girl, you know I'm gonna. Oh God, edge painting takes forever. But it is the easiest type of painting because literally you just have to paint within the line. Well, that's not easy for everyone. And do you see me ever painting inside the line? <laughs> I'm struggling. I'm all just like, get it on there. You're like, I have no patience for doing this one thing. I'm like, it'll look fine. As long as there's some kind of shine to it, people will believe that I spent more than the, however long I've spent on it. It's kind of rough right here. Oh, well. That's going to really absorb that color. Okay. I don't know why I went there, but I did. There it was. I was there. You can come back from there now. Okay, I'm back. It are was any, fun there. Are there any movies we should watch? Um, the one where I'm not holding in my gas. That would be the, <laughs> that would be a fun one. Uh, I think we'd all appreciate that. I think so. I, I there's so many movies. We have HBO Max, Hulu, Netflix. I know. So I'm asking if there's because I'm always like, oh, let's watch Netflix, and then basically I watch like 300 trailers on Netflix, and then I turn it off. Because I can't decide. Because we end up watching the BLs. I know. Thailand and Taiwan and Philippines Korea and Vietnam. And <laughs> anything, uh, as long as we can't understand what they're saying, we're down. They are bringing up, like, Sotus is on Netflix now. And a few other ones, actually. Jenna says, have you watched Cruella yet? I haven't. I don't know if I want to. Why? I, I don't know. I don't know why I said it that way. I just, I don't know. Is it because of all the hype? That, but also, like, I just, I'm not a fan of Cruella de Vil. Oh. I'm like, mm, you're crazy. Cool. Let me, know how, <laughs> let me know how you got there. She's on the mend, Kimball. She hates puppies. I'm sorry, but if you're an animal hater, I can't be friends with you. Maybe she wasn't. You don't know the backstory, Kimball. Maybe oh, you look. You just, uh, now Kimball, I, wipe that off. Wipe that off. Get off my painting. Oh, a shiny thumb. Oh my god, we I'm were, almost done. We were all very alarmed. This is the stage where Kimball just spills much down the front and was like, well, I was getting impatient. I kind of want to add like gold drips down the front. No joke. 
but I don't think it'll work on wood. I think it'll dry or like absorb too quickly, but it would look gorgeous. We all know it would. That's took, so fun. I love that. Took a lot of skill and patience on my part. You're welcome. Oh, tedious. I'm a little tediousness. Um, <laughs> all right. I'm going to toothbrush and spritzer. Don't get on your face. No, okay. You say that like, I wouldn't cover it with something. What is this? Who are you? All right. Mm, that's too big. Give me that. <laughs> Don't brush. look at her. <laughs> She's modest. I'm just waiting for a big one to be like, <laughs> <laughs> It's not your morning deuce, dude. <laughs> <laughs> We love a good gold spot. Get up here, which is really boring. Exactly. All right. Oh, look at my pretty thumb. Do more right there. Uh, here? In that very top corner, yep. I mean, there's quite a bit there. No, the you... very, very top corner. Tippy top, tippy top. Yep, all of it. Yep, that, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. There we <laughs> go. Great job. And that's how the professionals do it. All right. Cleaning off the thumb. I feel like I still need to put some on her face. <sighs> yeah, we're doing it. I'll try and keep it controlled. She wants a couple of gold freckles. It just looks too, too much. That's fine. Too, too much. You know what I'm saying? All right. Leah says, what are those metallic paints? Yeah, they are. They are the fine tech. Pearlescent colors. Boom. Boom, boom. Fine tech pearlescent colors. Where Worth can every... you get those, Kimball? You know, you can get them at another store. I got them at, uh, these ones I think I got at Blix. They probably have them at Michael's. I don't know if they have the full large set, though. Are you going to lift the, them off with a paper towel or just let them dry? Well, since it was just little splatters, I think I'll just let them dry. But they are gorgeous. I should probably get the edge, too. I don't know if that's really dry or not. Probably not a lot of water. I'm gonna have mica everywhere. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So, on the back though, you can see like there's silver. Is it there? There's the silver, mm -hmm. and the black's not really sparkly. And then there's gold next to it. And I did wipe off as much as I could with a paper towel just because I want to see how it would work. Because I these down here are two different acrylic golds. I also wiped those as thin because I was like testing things. Listen, you big glob of gook right there. Get off. Get off. What if you flip it around and there's like a bunch that you just put on her face with your fingers? Well, I'd be like, girl, you sparkly. I mean, I did splatter her face, so. I don't even know. Can you really see them? Uh, I never know. I wonder if like, okay, let's just turn this off real quick. Does that, are we? There you go. It's like that. Is that it? Do I get it? <laughs> She's so pretty. Oh, there's some sparkles there. Is there any other crazy vibrant color you want to add? Um, neon pink. Like, are you okay with all the wood here and stuff? L no, Rocky, let me ask, are you okay with all the wood there? <laughs> that's, that's what we should be asking. Scraps to be by Zondra says, she looks great hard. GT's Color for Wolf Thank says, you. very fun. Thank you. Should we add a little more pink down here just to kind of fill that in? I think so. Okay, watercolors or inks? Uh, do watercolors. Okay. Should I just do pink or blue? Um, I could bring like that blue down there. Yeah, like whatever this color is here would be fun. Okay, let me just get I'm my the screen just in case anyone's wondering. Uh, yeah, you are. I was watching. Where did I put my paintbrush? Did I put it away? I'm responsible. I put it away. Did I? Yeah, it's wet. Wet bristles. All right. Now I should wet this. It's gonna pick up the gold. That's fine. Just gonna add a little bit. It doesn't need to be a lot. Just something to make you go. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that looks cool. Oh, you look cool, Rocky. Thank you. You're like mm, my idol, American Idol. I'm like Keith. <laughs> and I like to dance. dance. Ooh, that's so pretty with the purple. <gasps> oh my god. Yes, yummy. What I I can't even think. Uh, you can't even think. I can't even think. That's true. Yeah, 
Now it's going to dry and be a lot lighter. Is that fine or should I go with something up here? Yes. What? Um, yes. Oh, well, that is correct. Pink. It's a different shade of pink. Just because, like, the blob of pink was drawing my eye to it too much, and that, like, focus should be on her face. Yeah, that's what it should be. I, listen, I am a professional artist. I know you are. I learned from you. I'm a professional, can sit back and tell you what to do. Oh, my God, and you are really good at it. Gilded edges look great. Thanks. Did somebody say that? Or are you Leah. just shouting at me? Leah, 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 Leah. 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 Who's Leah? Leah. Leah. Oh my gosh. Leah. Oh my god, I love that movie. Beautiful thing. When she's like super. The, the girl's name is Leah, and she loves Mama Cass, and she's like totally wasted. And this guy's like, Leah, Leah, be careful. Or whatever. She's like, Leah. Who's Leah? And he's all, <laughs> Mama Cass. Come with me, Mama Cass. Because she thought she was Mama Cass. Cute little story from my youth. I'm just gonna dry this because I don't know how light it's gonna get. Oh, now it looks weird because I didn't do blue right in here. Good enough. And that's how we make things up. Um, I'm going to. Add a dash of blue here. Just because the wood tone was matching to her skin tone. And I didn't like that. So, anything else, Rocky? Master of Art? I just want you to keep going forever. And ever. Hallelujah. For he's a jolly good fella. <laughs> For the Lord God omnipotent reign. <laughs> That's definitely not copyrighted. Hallelujah! Bobby says she's beautiful. Why, thank you, Bobby. And if Bobby was doing an ASMR, it would be like, she's beautiful. <laughs> You're like, wow. Well, you said it like a witch. Amy says she's purdy. Oh, she is. So just to refresh everybody who didn't make it to the very beginning, it was inspired. Can we censor the art piece, Kimball? Okay, what are we, amateur hour? Sometimes. it's romper room. Anyway, back to me and the important things I have to say. Okay. It was inspired by Alphonse Mucha's Job slash Job. I don't know. I've heard it pronounced both ways. I would say Job. But also, he's from Czechia, so whatever. True. Um, which we are probably going to go to the Alphonse Mucha Museum. Super excited. Yes. Things to look forward to. Just a hop, skip, and a jump from Paris. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm excited. So, Scraps I think by Zondra it. says, love her heart. Thank you. I, oh, 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 need to set her aside and draw an eyeball with paint pen pinpoint things. And I'm going to draw it in this little black book that I got Some Where's my little black book? I don't know. You have a little black book? Is it this one right here? Yeah. My little black book of secrets. I put a couple numbers in there. But this is when I was testing things on black paper because I wish it didn't cross transfer. That's why I don't use a layer cakes inside journals because I am such a, like, I hate cross transferring stuff. I love it, but I hate that. So, you know, it's me. But layer I'm, cakes. But, he doesn't want to use the layer cakes in this instance. <laughs> but I use them on like loose things like I used it on the piece just now. Trying out white paint pen. This was power pastels and I melted it with a craft gun and like smeared it with my fingers. It burned. <laughs> Worth it though. <laughs> this was colored pencil. This was Jane, like the pigments that I got off Jane's thing. There it goes. Shiny, shiny, shimmy, shimmy, shiny. Um, okay, let's try and draw an eyeball. I'm just going to grab a couple colors. This I love this dark blue. I don't even like blue, but like this color, I was like, yes, I love it. It's so vibrant. Um, a couple of skin tones, maybe like a. I don't know how that's gonna look. We'll see. 
I'm sure I just heard Rocky's cheeks clapping. No, it was so. definitely my hands. Okay. <laughs> sure, Jan. Beyonce says, cover it with fixative or hairspray. That should help the transfer. Yeah, I'm too lazy. He's not going to do it. I have He's not going to do it. I have fixative, but it smells like god-awful ass, and I'm not putting it on my <laughs> artwork. <laughs> like, I just, you know, won't do it. I'm just the, shaking up all the, the pens, The acronym for that is GAS, just so you know. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. God awful ass. It's God. It's God. Um, Denise says, I have those journals. It might this be one? yours. She, he might have oh. taken it. <laughs> I think, who is it? Ravely? Wakely? Ravely? Ranger? I don't know what you're talking about. Is Ranger Danger? Ranger Danger? The art people get it. Can we just film can, you doing this? I can't do it with my left screen. hand. Wait, do, it on, do it on screen. Thank you. That's much more entertaining. This is how we do it. Broggy's all, oh, your little cheek shake last time I did this. <laughs> all, oh, thank you. No, I love that. Okay. Uh, the pressure's on. Okay, we're just going to sketch out a little eyeball because, you know. So the point of this is to do some cross hatching technique. Well, is that right? I, it's, I don't, it's. It's not true cross hatching because it's not like wah wah wah. It's it's scribbles and bibbles and bops and boos. It's whatever Kimmel wants to do right now. Yeah, I do need Everyone a. Everyone observe. <laughs> I need a. Hey Nona. Just want to get a sketch out first. Lashes, tear duct, under the eyeball, lower lashes. And we'll have some kind of eyelid creasy thing. And is it showing up at all? Yes. Should we zoom in? Yes. Yeah, you can. Or should I do it on like white paper? I'm just try it on here first. You're already here. Paper. All right. Just don't move. Okay. Okay. So this, I mean, it's gonna. You'll see it eventually. It's just. I'm doing dark on dark. Sleeves up. Jenna says it's a delusions journal, and Aaliyah says I see the sparkle. Sparkly delicious. So. Green. Normally, I would let the paint dry so it actually like went over top easier. But who's got that time? No one. Just I'm trying to use some brighter colors so you can actually see what the heck I'm doing. Yeah, like it's still wet there, so it's just mixing in weird. But whatever, my God, don't judge. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Put a pop of pink. Pop a pink. Normally, I probably wouldn't draw it so bright, but hey, what you gonna do? Just want the shape there so you guys can get a better visual. <laughs> so It's still so wet. Hold on. Calm down. How long does it take to dry? Plug your ears, everybody. Yeah, you know, it's still so funny. It's like hilarious. <laughs> I do it just to see how you're gonna react. I just stare at you and think, mm, that's my man. Married him. <gasps> Our anniversary is coming up. All right. So, dark creases. And we'll basically just start with the dark colors. Not too much just yet. I'm also, it helps like to draw your lines the way the shape is going. If that makes sense, like her cheek goes this way. I don't. I don't really know how to explain that. Um, somebody else that is, you know, an art teacher. Follow the natural lines of the face. <laughs> is that what you're trying to say? No. Yes. <laughs> All right. This is. Wait. Let's just start with the lightest color. That way, it'll just show up faster. So basically, I'll just go light to dark. Leah says, "I love that color combo." Oh, thank you. I came up with it just now. <laughs> so, okay. Oh, I should probably draw the eyebrow too. Okay, hold on, hold on. Got an eyebrow coming. Don't rush it, it's an eyebrow. This is important stuff. Well, it helps knowing where the highlights are because now I can actually tell where my highlight's gonna be. Do you need mm -hmm. to dry that? Yeah. Yours. <laughs> I'm gonna send you to your room. My room is still within like talking. I'm all, you go out back and you give me a switch right now. Mm. All right. So right here is the a brow. A switch? Yes. A switch? So there's the brow bone and the eyebrow kind of goes right through it in my art anyway. 
And so like one of the brightest highlights is kind of here and it's right where the temple meets the forehead is kind of, I don't want to draw the weird shapes, but it's there. <laughs> <laughs> it's there in my world. And then we'll have light usually hits the flat area on the inside of your eye right here. And not necessarily on your eyelid, but come on, let's be real. I'm gonna make that pop. And then she does have the waterline already. And there is gonna be under the eyelid, it'll pop out a lot more. I'm not totally making this up as I go, by the way. <laughs> Sounds good to me. I'm this is practically ready to go up at Barnes and Noble. I know, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so here's the medium skin tone that I pulled out. So now we're just gonna, feel oh, that's gray. Is it gray? Is it Kimball gray? What are you? Perhaps. Oh, shiny. Whatever, we're gonna go with it. It's an eye. An eye for an eye. So this will go kind of in the middle because it's the mid-tone. You sound like you were just singing Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. I kind of I kind of went the there. Tomatoes. I kind of went there. And I just honestly I just keep playing with it until I like it. I will just keep scratching layers over and over. Okay, he says, Oh, so you don't necessarily have the lines curved then? Was that your ass? No, it was just my stomach. Sure, Jan. It sure. Was. Okay. Ooh. Um, I don't have the lines curved. How do you say? What do you mean? Are you curving the lines as you draw them? They're not perfectly straight, right? No, no, no. Like I said, it's not true cross hatching. So they are curved. Correct. Okay. Because I, I like to follow the shape of the face a little bit. Grab my dark. And then, and then I, like, this is cross hatching. Like, I'll bring that in. And then I can so bring it in. So this is on the border of scribble bops. Yes, but this is hatching over those scribbles. Okay. We're getting a lot of texts it's from our, our friend. It's our friend Nick. What is he saying? He wants to know if we're going to be going to California for a wedding. Uh, you know, I don't know because of all the other things that we're doing. We will see. That is not for lifetime. That is for after lifetime. What? Oh, gotcha. Leah says, I end up putting paper towel sheets between, I'm uh, sorry, paper towels between sheets in my journals to prevent the transfer. Yep, still too lazy. <laughs> I used to put um, clear like cellophane sheet thingies, but here I am not doing that anymore. I'm sorry, are you yawning? I'm sorry, I'm, I'm not yawning. That's right. No, I was, because I don't have enough caffeine in my system, probably. Can we just get off that? Yes. <laughs> Here, I well, now I have nothing to talk about. It's not caffeine, I don't know what to say. Oh. So basically, once I've got all my scribblies down, you can come back in and hatch away at it. I feel like I'm really learning. Well, you should be. And then, I didn't, oh, I can use this purple. Just use it. Hey, don't be difficult. Oh, it probably has paper towel on it. Don't ask why. Just a little shadow. On the eye burr. I'm gonna get a little yellow. Add some yellow to the eye, cause why not? Back to the dark green and mix that a little. And then give it a little dry. I feel like I should use a light blue for highlights on the brow. Oh, that's a glittery one. Yeah, that'll work. Well, that doesn't take that long to dry, right? No. That blue looks so pretty. Like off camera, like looking at the journal, it's so beautiful. And they're talking about this, yeah. Like, if the camera is not picking up how pretty that is, it's blue. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back with it in just a second. I just mean, like, in person, it's so much more vibrant. I know, right? Like, why is the camera not picking that up? Well, it's gone now. <laughs> well, I'm gonna, I'm just kidding. It's fine. <laughs> 
You're so funny, man. <laughs> oh my God, you guys. Leah says I have to prep my pin pinpoint paint pens tonight. Oh my God, it's it's a workout. Four. So now I'm gonna come back in, and this is my blackish color. And the first layer you lay down kind of absorbs into the paper. So if you're working on black, it, it might fade a little bit, but then you can come back in and it'll start showing up a little bit better. But it covers, like it goes over so nicely. I'm so fascinated by this. I'm fascinated by you. I don't, like, I don't even know what technique this is that you were asked to do or like that you're doing. I've never really seen you do it. It's like I scribble and then I cross hatch on top of it. I see that now. <laughs> So there you go. Well, it's not dry at all, but she ain't mad at it. Brow kapow. Brow kapow? Yeah. I'm definitely adding that into the dictionary. <laughs> adding just that pop of color on the, you know, brow. I get to flip the page on this dictionary. I'm so excited. And then maybe brow I'll add kapow. a little red. Do shiny red. Why not? Get that marker mixed in. Might be really dark. I'm scared, Will. I shook out too much. Ooh, she fancy. Anyway, you just keep building out like that. Like you like you know how I mean? Because if I just did the whole cheek, that would be so much paint from these little tiny paint pens. But Jane, who's so freaking smart, um, she was like, I draw a little bit, and then she'll like wet her brush, like with a wet paintbrush, and she'll kind of dab it and it like bleeds out. So that's a cool thing that you can do too. Thinking about trying it, like to do a painting with it. Not tonight, no. But Bra there you go. Brow kapow, adding vibrant colors or textures when painting eyebrows. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. We added a lot to the dictionary today that I was not anticipating, Kimball. We added scribble bops. Scribble bops and doodles. Loopy boops. Sounds like a bra. Fajudged it up. Oh, that sounds like a feminine problem. Blibbity blops. Blibbity blops. <laughs> and. <laughs> These all sound like really bad sexual brow issues. Brow kapow. I hope brow kapow is not a sexual thing. Mm, I don't um, know. <laughs> so, we'll <laughs> so we'll keep adding to that one. Oh, we're gross. Oh, um, we're 12. Wow. So, so yes, that's that's how I draw with the paint pens. Also, I like to do just little things like this, too, where it's like, you know, it's just a cute, simple little thing. The white was done with that. It's the Jane's uh, Storytime paint pen. Storytime paint pen. Storytime paint pen. And then I just did all the line work with the little pin, pinpoint paint pens. P4. P4, which I still think is a protein snack. At like 7-Eleven. I mean, that's pretty much what it sounds like. What's the P for? I'm gonna oh, wow. put out this delicious scented vanilla blueberry candle by DW Home. Okay. I'm gonna so. unscrew this camera that is blazingly hot on my fingertips when I touch the back of it. Mm. And bring it down, hopefully it might, without disconnecting it. Maybe it'll cut out any second. We really live on the edge here. I hope not. We moved your thing right there. We moved that. Thanks, Kimball. I did. I'm a good person. All right, let's see the piece, Kimball. Here she is, my Mooka knockoff. Hold it up. Oh, Kimball. We'll get some close-ups. Can you get does it does it need to be angled? There you go. The, Hold it right there. Hold just right see there, them glittery bits. Ooh, she's like a mermaid with like gold scales. Oh, that's what I was going for. She's a mermaid. Another one for the fridge. She's a little chonky for the fridge. Okay. <laughs> well, put some hefty magnets on the back. It'll be fine. Some magnets. There you go. Look at this mess I get to clean up. <laughs> so, Kimball, that yes. was fun. Did it turn out the way you wanted? <sighs> well, I didn't really have a preconceived notion, but I like how it turned out. Okay, good. I mean, I wanted to look somewhat like the picture that I was working from, so... Success? <laughs> nice. Scraps to Beauty by Zandra says, Heart. Jenna <laughs> says, Love it. Or look um, at my Elaine, double chin. Elaine said, I'm sorry, here, I'll come up. Kimball, is that better? Yes, this is how I take all my pictures. If you see me on Facebook and I'm all like, hmm, can we hide the double chin? Kitty says, so <laughs> pretty, Kimball. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Scratch Beauty says, it was fun. Thanks. Thank and then you. Thanks um, Elaine says, I'm sure Brow Kapow is different to Batman. 
Kapow! Bam! There you go. Perfect. But he does have those intense brows. Why does he say it's overheating now? Oh, he's just cut out any moment. Uh, Denise says she's here. divine. Oh, yeah. Thank you. I think so, And too. the painting's nice, too. Um, I think oh, it's like, I think it's dying. <laughs> <laughs> it's all here. Um, don't forget to like the video if you haven't already. Like and subscribe what for quality content such as this. <laughs> <laughs> so, Kimball, what's in store for you for this week? A lot of traveling. A lot of travel. Oh, yes, that brings me back to next. Brings me back. I didn't even go there in the first place. Brings me to next Sunday. Uh, we will be going live. I didn't think we were, but we're coming back on Sunday. So we might be exhausted and totally, like, crapped out, but we're going to go live. There you go. Perfect. I'll do it for you. You'll enjoy, you'll enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be so great. I have no... Yeah, it's going to be a very long week. We've got a lot of out-of-town work to do. And then we're back for a few days, and then we're out of town again for a few days. And, and then are we going to go live from Boise? Uh, we could try. I don't know what I'm going to take with me, because I don't want to take a bunch of our stuff. Maybe we'll buy something there and cheap art supply it. Boise Art Supply Challenge. <laughs> <laughs> like they don't have art stores there. <laughs> All right, cool. Well... That was fun, y'all. Thanks for joining us. Big hugs and all that. Anything else? I don't... What more can I give? You want to drag this out a bit more? Uh, drag like my dream. Not my dream, but that dream where the girl had a dream of us we were dragging. Yes, exactly. All right, hold this over your painting, Kimball. Okay, I won't hit off, cut it. hit off button. Don't, go, don't hit the off button. Okay. And then give us that sign-off music. There's the eye, there's the coffee, there's the girl inspired by Mooka, Alphonse Mooka. I tried. La da da, bye bye bye, see you next time I tried. Uh -uh.